Good morning, Huskies. Today is Tuesday, September 10th. I'm Cam. And I'm Lindsay. And we have your morning announcements. NEHS members, there is a meeting today after school in the Media Center. Please pay your $25 dues via My School Bucks by October 1st. If you would like to get started with your service hours, donate five items to Doran Relief for one service hour. Check out eCampus for what's needed and bring the items to Ms. Gendro in room 2122 by September 19th. Sign up on our eCampus page to stay on top of information. Homecoming guest forms are available on the Haggerty website. All forms are due by September 24th, no exceptions. Attention NTHS members, the meeting we missed because of Hurricane Doran will be held on Tuesday, September 19th, right after school in Ms. Parker's room. Also, we are collecting relief items for those affected by the hurricane in the Bahamas. Check out the board in Ms. Parker and Ms. Burrell's room for needed items. Five items donated will give you one service hour. Junior, junior privilege forms are available on the HHS website. They are due to Ms. Small or Ms. Keller not later than October 16th. No late forms will be accepted for privilege days. Are you interested in participating in the dodgeball tournament being held on Wednesday, October 3rd during homecoming week? Form a team, print the registration form and the waiver for, form the Haggerty website and bring them to Ms. Miller in room 6117 with $12 per team. All grade levels are encouraged to participate. Seniors, do you need to improve your SAT scores to get into the college you want to attend? Haggerty is offering an SAT boot camp for the first 25 students who sign up and pre preference will be given to seniors, so sign up right away. The boot camp will be held on September 21st through the 28th and October 12th from 8 a.m. to 11 a.m. To sign up, email Ms. Rasha or Ms. Yaroma. Students, you are invited to join Ms. Jung on a once-in-a-lifetime international travel experience with your friends and family during the summer of 2020 to China. Come here all the details including the destination, itinerary, and cost of the trip as well as the official opening of enrollment. The meeting for this trip will be held tomorrow evening at 6 o'clock p.m. in the Media Center. There are a limited number of spots for this trip, so come with your family to learn more about this exciting opportunity. If you have any questions, you may stop by room 6214 to ask Ms. Young. The Foundation for Seminole County Public School is once again hosting Arts Live, its major fundraiser. This fundraiser is a gala that includes 10 to 15 performances by SCPS students, faculty, and staff. Auditions for this event will be held in early October, so if you have talent, start working on your audition piece now. Stay tuned for promos, and then we'll be right back. Hey Huskies, High Year's annual talent show, The H Factor, is looking for you. The H Factor will be held on October 1st this year, so send in your audition papers and video to Ms. Parker in room 2115, TV production, or through email. And cash prizes will be awarded for first, second, and third places, so secure your spot now. Are you interested in joining the dodgeball tournament this year? It will be held October 3rd during homecoming week. If you would like to participate, go to Ms. Miller's room 61117 with $12 print out the re registration and waiver form from the Haggerty website and we'll see you there. Play a musical instrument? Then we need you. All SCPS students and employees are invited to audition for this year's Arts Alive and Seminole event. Auditions will be held October 7th and 9th. Sign up before Tuesday, October 1st by visiting the Foundation's website or talking to your fine arts teacher. If selected, you'll perform at Arts Alive and Seminole on Saturday, November 16th at the Weston Lake Mary. Sign up today and break a leg! back. 
Haggerty's annual talent show, The H Factor, is looking for talented Huskies to participate in this year's competition. This is a competitive show and cash prizes are awarded for first, second, and third places. The show this year is on Tuesday, October 1st during homecoming week. Sign up today to secure your spot in the event. Audition videos should be submitted to Miss Parker and TV production through email or can be dropped off in room 2115. Deadline to audition this has been extended to Friday, September 13th. Just a reminder to last year's participants, if you performed in the talent show last year, you are invited to participate again this year and you do not have to audition. What you must do, however, is fill out an application form which you can pick up at the talent show board located outside of TV production room to 115 or in Fine Arts Building Hallway 9. Would you like to travel to London, Paris, and Madrid? If so, please join us for an informational meeting in the group projects room this Thursday evening, September 12th at 7 p.m. We are planning on traveling during spring break 2021 and we'd love for you to join us. Now to your Husky Sports. Hey Huskies, I'm Zach with your sports. Have you downloaded the Spirit app yet? This week there are three opportunities to check in at home events. Tonight, Girls Varsity Volleyball takes on Lyman at 7 and Thursday, Girls JV Volleyball takes on Oviedo at 7 at Oviedo. Friday night, the varsity football team takes on Timber Creek. Attend one or all of these home games and collect your points. In cross-country action last Saturday, Kaylee Rod finished 19th with a time of 20.51, and Reagan Eastlick finished 71st with a time of 18.06 to lead the Huskies at the 50-team Astronaut Invitational. Rod led the girls to a 13th place finish. Eastlick paced the boys to a 21st place finish. As I just mentioned, at the varsity volleyball team plays tonight against Lyman at 7. The freshmen also play at home tonight at 4.30 and the JV girls play at 5.30. Tomorrow, the boys golf team takes on DeLand at Twin Rivers and the girls travel to Castleberry to take on Lake Howell. The girls and boys bowling teams take on Crooms at home tomorrow. Pins drop at 3.30 at the Oviedo Bowling Center. And the softball team travels to Lake Mary High School to take on Lyman and Lake Mary. That's all for sports today. Now back to the studio. That will do it for the announcements today. From all of us here at Wolf TV, have a great day, and as always, Go, go Huskies! Huskies.